Hey everyone, it's Rocky, and I'm back again with some more Mystic Messenger. So, we've got all of these, and now V's got one, which he didn't before. Oh, and I've, I've got a thing. Ooh, okay, cool. So my name is here, and my picture, and I'm an RFA member. Oh, and it tells me what DLC I have, that's pretty cool. Ending achievement, two out of seven, what? How do I only have two out of se- oh, because I don't have the other DLC. That makes sense. Four out of seven, wait, I don't- I don't get it then. Why- why do I have only two for Juman? Whatever. Um... Maybe just didn't load properly or something. And do I still have all my old pictures? Uh, yeah. Do it. Thanks. Okay, so I've still got all of the pictures from before. That's cool. I've got 14 V pictures. Remove these. Don't look at this. Okay, that's cool. So, everything is still here. I'm just double checking to make sure everything, but you know. So let's, uh, let's start with these. And let's start with, um, ooh, Ray. Okay, Zen. Hi, Mila. This is the first time I'm texting with someone other than members of the RFA. Uh, uh, no. Hi Mila, this is the first time that I'm texting with someone other than the members of the RFA. Don't worry, even if Juman and Jayhi are suspicious of you, it's just that they are the most prudent members of RFA. Okay. Um, I'm suspicious of you guys as well. It's a relief you're here. And then we'll talk to um, Ray. I'm guessing your chat with the AIs is over. You can keep talking to them like you did just now, okay? I think it's too complicated. Sure, as long as you help me. And be cute. Uh, v. I didn't think I'll hear about Rika for the first time in months from a complete stranger, but I think it's fate that we met. Rika is the master key. I hope that we can get along well. I'll talk to you in a minute. Okay? Okay. Uh, Jaehee. This is Jay Hee Kang. I'm not sure how you'll take this, but please do not trouble the other members. I'm a newcomer. Do you have to be so harsh? I'd like to talk to you than I'd like to talk to you than the other members. Um, since you're in a chat room, I can text you, right? I should hack the texts too. Haha. <laughs> System failure. Your text cannot be sent. Ha ha ha! It's a joke. Joking is good. Okay, Zen, yes. Oh good. That must have been harsh for you. If they keep doing that to you, pretend that you didn't read what they said and talk to me only. I'm all ears. Every time! You're just cute all the time. All the time. Okay. I'll help you as long as you're here, as long as you don't leave me. Oh, I'm not gonna leave you. I really do like him. Like a lot. Maybe not as much as seven, but you know. Almost. I too hope we can work together to su to a success. I'd like to hear about you and what you know about Rika. All you care about is Rika! Uh, but you, Sung, or V will find themselves greatly confused by your every word. Or I'd rather have you talk to me uh, than to see that happen. Okay? <laughs> I know you're kidding. I'm the god of this place, though having you here was not part of my plan. Anyway, that was kind of fun. <laughs> so cute. Okay, let's see what everybody, what, what we've got for everyone else. I'm always following the path of the latest trend. Who needs flowers when you have me? Oh, this is pretty. Chirp, chirp, chirp. With the Milky Way galaxy. Rip. Note, check the door before returning home. Man, this looks good. I am so hungry right now. And welcome Mila. Thanks, V. So do we have... What do we have for chat rooms? The importance of meals. Okay, let's do that. Did you have lunch yet, Mila? I know the previous members' meal habits. So I wonder what yours is like, Mila. I can eat up to six meals per day. I only eat twice per day. I don't care how many times I eat. I'm the zealous believer in butter, chocolate, flour, and soft drink. Three regular meals each day. That's my motto. Y 
you are staying true to the first step of being healthy. I tend to skip breakfast a lot, but I try my, my God, okay. Shh. But I try my best to get my meals when I have to. As for me, I'm up for a new challenge today. Hmm. Shoot. This is the new CS24 convenience store lunchbox meal. Launched last week. That's one glamorous lunchbox. What? Why would you eat a lunchbox from a convenience store? You should really eat better. Don't broken heart. She won't talk to me. Oh, there we go. You shouldn't underestimate lunchboxes these days. Of course, they can't be better than what's provided by luxurious restaurants, but the merit of this lunchbox is that you easily and conveniently feed my goodness shh shh my god feed yourself T jesus take a good look at the picture there's the right amount of rice and there are nine different types of side dishes moreover there is not only meat but also vegetables i agree that this is all in one nutrition packed huh mila you sung jehi you're eating a lunchbox from a convenience store. It's nutritious. Look at Yusung. She's eating a lunchbox from a convenience store. Wah! Hello, Yusung. Hey. Wait. This is the time for lunch. Did you have She's... lunch, Yusung? No. I couldn't eat. My chest feels stuffed. Do you have a bad stomach? I think I upset my stomach emotionally. Is it because you're frustrated when you think about V? Is it because I joined? Or... No, no. This isn't your fault. It's because Rika's name came up. I've been thinking about her. And my stomach started to heave as well. I didn't even get breakfast. I doubt you'll be able to focus on your classes on an empty stomach. I was never a diligent student anyway. <laughs> I've decided, I've declared a holiday for myself. You must be feeling really complicated. That sounds like a waste of your tuition. I do. Ever since Rika's name came up, I couldn't study at all. I haven't heard that name for so long, and it's a joy to hear it. But it also pains me hearing it. I couldn't expect anything else. Jehi, can I ask you something? Yes, go ahead. Jehi, do you think that V really loved Rika? Of course I do. But I believe you or Mr. Han would know better. You and he have watched those two by their side, and thus know better. I don't know. I keep thinking that what I've seen was surface only. Don't you think he did love her? He's continuing the charity association founded by his lover. What about Rika? Do you think she truly loved Fee? The relationship is their issue. Don't you think a third party's evaluation is really meaningless? A party is something we all do together. I believe they indeed loved each other, which is why the situation is so heartbreaking. That's what I want to think, too. But I keep finding questions unanswered. Questions. And you know what? Do you think there was no sign at all before she took away her life? Before Rika died, V was the one closest to her, wasn't he? If she had been emotionally stressed or expressing what she was feeling, V would have been the one among us to witness that, right? That's highly likely. But life just doesn't go how its owner plans. V has also lost his precious lover. He'll be going through a hard time as well. You shouldn't be so harsh on him. Perhaps V and Rika weren't that close. I agree with Mila. Ooh, I got a V heart. V was the one closest to Rika among us. 
I'm sure he'd feel the greatest loss among us. I think our role is to comfort the man who has lost his beloved, rather than making him responsible for all that happened. The rest of the members are already doing more than enough, and they got nothing but silence and secrets in return. Even if there really is a secret, he wouldn't do anything that can harm the RFA, would he? What secrets? And that's what Mr. Han said. But I don't really mind a lot about the secrets. V couldn't even stop what happened to Rika. I think he's already causing enough harm to the RFA, but he keeps making secrets while he's at it. Talking about security and stuff, but he couldn't even protect Rika. Yu Sung, I understand how you feel, but that's not really V's fault. I know I'm not supposed to think like this, but maybe V didn't really know about her. I doubt it. He didn't even know who Mila was. But isn't that the same for you, Yu Sung? Well, I. I was never her boyfriend. There's no need to tell everything, even between a couple. That's different from my definition of a couple. I don't know about Rika and V's relationship, but you should first calm down. It feels unnatural that they didn't share everything to each other. They're lovers, you know. Calm down. I'd say that you and V definitely don't have any sort of connection, Mila. You didn't even know that Rika no longer exists in this world. But both of them know Rika? Is this really possible? Of course, I know you, Yusung, and your friends know you. But your friends and I basically know nothing about each other's relationship with you. Is that how it is? Hmm. Yusung, you suspect V, and Mr. Han and I suspect Mila. I think this is where your bad thoughts end. It's not bad thoughts. Did you say you skipped lunch and breakfast? Yep. Why not try eating something? I told you my chest feels stuffed and I just can't eat. I think you should calm down first. Want me to feed you myself? I think you should calm down. Yes, I agree. I think right now you have too much on your mind. Your thoughts would be rewired if you do something else. If you keep thinking about a single topic, there's no end to it. So try eating something, or try doing something else. Before your head keeps getting connected to bad thoughts. I think those thoughts are in alignment with reasonable suspicion. Whatever it is that you have to do, you should eat first. That was the RFA chat room, the den, a flourish of suspicion and conspiracy. Eat first. Yes, she's right. Oh, you know I'm a girl! Thinking bad thoughts on an empty stomach will only harm your health, Yusung. Don't you want to show faith to our new member instead of suspicion? It's true, but... Then run along. But my lunch is one thing. What about you, Jaehee? What happened to that lunchbox that you just took a picture of? You mean this lunchbox that I had to leave stranded because of you? Oh! You should hurry up and eat, Jaehee. You should get something, Yusung. How about a cup of tea? You should hurry up and eat, Jaehee. I plan to. Come on. Enjoy your lunch, Jaehee. Thank you. You too, Yusung. Sure. I'll try finding something that can work, even on a stuffed stomach. I should get a tea or something. I should get a water ready. Enjoy the rest of your day, Mila. I'll chat with you both later. Farewell, Yusung. Yes, bye. Jay, you should hurry up and eat too. I'm a bit worried about him. Yes, same here. Yusung. He's skipping meals and his classes. He's living alone, so no one would be there to, to take care of these things for him. He reminds me of myself a few years ago. How sad. If your body deteriorates while living alone, so does your heart. I was hoping he'd enjoy his campus life. That's not a very good start. Lunchtime would be over soon, so I'd better leave now. Enjoy your lunch, Jaehee. 
hope you enjoy your lunch too, Mila. I got five hearts. Score! And a call from Yusung. Ah, it's hot, it's hot. Tea. Oh? Why are you talking about the phone? Hello? That's right. Hi. I'm going to get a phone and I'm going to get a phone and I'm going to get a phone. I'm sorry. 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 차 향기만 맡아도 마음이 조금 편안해진 것 같아요. Did you say ouchy and hurt yourself from the hot tea? It's good that you feel more at ease. Are you okay? Did you get hurt? 네, 손가락 끝에 살짝 닿긴 했는데 이 정도는 끄떡 없어요. 허벅지에 엎질렀다면 이야기는 완전 달랐겠지만 <웃음> 걱정해줘서 고마워요. 음, 아까 채팅방에서 말이에요. 제가 조금 예민하게 굴었었죠. 당신을 의심해서 그런 건 아니에요. 배고파서 조금 날이 서 있었나 봐요. 혹시 저 때문에 불편하셨다면 미안해요. 지금은 간단하게 뭐좀 먹었는데. 배가 부르고 나니 아까 한 행동들이 막 후회되는 거 있죠. I was about to give you a piece of my mind. It's okay. Don't worry about it. We can keep cool in the future. Everyone's like that when they're hungry. 이해해 주셔서 고마워요. 제이 누나 말이 맞나 봐요. 밥을 먹으면 마음이 좀 느긋해지는 것 같아요. 앞으로는 진짜 굶지 말고 간단하게라도 뭐좀 챙겨 먹어야겠어요. 그쪽이 RFA에 들어온 이상 모두들 다 같이 행복하게 잘 지냈으면 좋겠어요. 개기야 어쨌건 그쪽도 이제 같은 멤버가 됐잖아요. 우리 잘해봐요. 저는 이제 더는 슬픈 일이 없었으면 좋겠어요. Would it be okay to date other members? I'll try my best not to see a bad ending. Trust me, I'll make you happy. 누나요? 그쪽 저보다 연상이세요? Yes. 그리고 전 아직 그쪽에 대해 모르는 거 투성이에요. 그런 프로포즈 같은 말 하기엔 좀 이른 것 같아요. 아 근데 살짝 두근거리긴 했어요. 행복이라 전 말이에요. 지나가는 커플들 보면. 다들 행복해 보였거든요. 그래서 막연히 리카 누나랑 브이 형도 행복했을 거라 생각했는데 제가 연인이라는 거에 너무 환상을 가지고 있는 걸까요? Let's talk about something else other than Rika. Relationships start from fantasizing about each other. Everyone thinks so much of Rika, she must have been happy. 정말 그럴까요? 사실이 아니더라도 그쪽 말을 믿고 싶네요. 과거로 돌아갈 수만 있다면 리카 누나에게 행복했냐고 묻고 싶어요. 저는 누나가 행복했길 바래요. 그리고 누나가 어떻게 죽었는지도 자세히 알고 싶어요. 누나는 그렇게 자신의 삶을 쉽게 놓을 사람이 아니었거든요. 아무리 생각을 털어내려고 해도 자꾸 리카 누나 생각이 나네요. 아, 맞다. 아까 제이 누나가 다른 행동을 하면 생각이 전환된다고 했어요. 방 청소라도 하면서 머리 좀 식혀야겠어요. 더 이상한 소리 하기 전에 이만 끊을게요. 다음에 통화해요. 오케이. Okay. And I got a new message from Jehi. Oh my goodness. Uh, he's a... Okay. Uh... I cannot tell you much about the RFA, but what do you think about the fact that I eat lunch boxes by myself during lunch or at the company? I think it's a bit lonely to eat alone. You can get whatever you want. I think it's a bit lonely to eat alone. New album stuff? New Jehi? What's new Jehi? Oh, her. Okay. That's cool. Alright, well, I'm going to go ahead and end this episode here for today. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you want to see more videos from me, then don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Thanks for watching.